Her name is Johanna Kushimo. I'm from uh, Otako district, under Abuja region. I'm here to testify the goodness of the Lord in my life and my family. I have a son. His name is Jeremiah Olamide Kushimo. Some years back, we found out that the child has a hole in his heart. And uh, our Father in the Lord, pray for him before I travel out of the country to London. When we go to London, for them to walk on the hole, to close it up, we could not find it again. They try and try and try and look for it because I have a letter given to me from Nigeria, here, from Nigeria here. I show them, they look at it. Where is the hole? We cannot find it anymore. After its ministration. The latest one, there are so many, but time will not permit me. Though I have shared this in my district during one of our fellowship. By the grace of God, I'm saved. The latest one is during our happy crusade. We are here in front of us five. My child was my child sat, my child, my son sat on the wheelchair. And when our father in the Lord said, If you're on the wheelchair, get up now. I saw him jump up and move forward. Then we are about to, some of my, our brethren here were about to help him. But we had a voice also from our father said, he said, don't touch them. The power of God is upon them. Don't touch them. The work has already worked, worked on them. So we could not touch him that day. But the old leg was shaking. I was looking at the leg, shaking, shaking for so long. We went home. On the 27th of that of April, I found out that online, we are online. I found out that he could not, our father said, if you're on the wheelchair, come out. The same word came up again. And he, he jumped up, about to fall down. So we caught him in our parlor there. And uh, to testify what God did, Without this autosis that I'm holding, it cannot work. They have told me in Israel, I was in Israel for almost a year. I was in US too for some for some months. We were told that the pelvic has been destroyed unless there's artificial done on the pelvic. He cannot walk on his own. They showed me. They brought all the bones, the history of the bones out, and they showed me. So this is the, this is the third autosis, but this is the he will never use this again. Because on that twenty seventh, I found out that he can walk. If you see him, he's walking from outside. There. That that day of uh, when we started this program, he walked from. Of five years to car park, I could not believe it. With his uh, working frame, the Lord has started His work on him, and I believe He will perfect it. Amen. And if you are here this evening, and you have a hole in the heart, or your child had a hole in the heart, right now the hole is filled in Jesus' name. Amen. And also. If you are using a stick or something to walk, like this one that we are no more using, it costs millions of money, but we will never use it again in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I Put your hands connected. together for Jesus. Put your hands together for Jesus. That's divine connection. Hole in the heart gone. No paralysis gone. 
You can see the gadget that uh, the boy was using. Wouldn't need it again. The Lord has done it. Connection brings miracle. And you receive yours tonight in Jesus' name. The same man of God that God used to pronounce this miracle is going to be used again tonight to pronounce your own miracle. You get connected. You get your blessings in Jesus' name. The next testifier. Praise the Lord. Praise Master Jesus. I'm Sister Bisong Juliana. I'm from Buari region, Kuduru Central. I want to testify of the greatness of God upon my life. It all started January this year. I wrote some petitions and said, God, I want to be healthy to serve you. But the devil told me, okay, you serve God very well, you wait. And it struck me with, uh, I, I couldn't describe the pain right from my chest. And when it starts, it's, it, the pain increases to my back. It will look as if I want to pass out. And when I heard that our father was coming, before they made the announcement that he was coming, I already saw him in the dream. And we were like, we are standing, four of us. And he said, comfort. And I came closer to him and he was talking to me and that was how I woke up in that dream. I started saying, God, I know that my deliverance is sure. On that April, when he was to come, it was our turn to be here. I couldn't come because of the pain. I had to tell my children to go. But I connected online with our daddy in the Lord. And I said, God, even as I'm here, I will receive my own miracle. And God Almighty, that very night, I saw myself as if I went to the toilet. And the things that came out of me, I couldn't describe it. And from that moment till now, I am made whole. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah, made whole. Put your hands together for Jesus. The Lord did it. The Lord did it. Miracle power. Couldn't come physically, but connected online. All the online audience, get yours also tonight. And all who are there physically, you have no reason why you shouldn't get your miracle. You receive in Jesus' name. Amen. Next testifier. Praise the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. By the grace of God, I've given my life to Christ. And my name is Bosse Solomon from Buari, Zumawan District. I want to testify to the goodness of the Lord, what the Lord has done in my life. Since December last year, I've been having a severe headache. And we treat it, we go and come back. It will go and come back. It will go and come back. So it started again since last month. Till this month, I said, ah, I will not, sometimes I will just buy pasta more. I will take the whole satchel. I will not feel any relief. But when I heard that her daddy is coming, I said, God, I must receive my healing. And God really, in fact, I connected from home. We, we, it's today that it's our turn to be here. So on Saturday, on Friday, I connected. With the, when daddy was praying, I prayed along, I touched my head, and immediately after the prayer, I saw that the something had gone a little. I said, God, please perfect it. On Saturday, I thank the name of the Lord that he perfected it. I said, may his name be exalted in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Don't be satisfied with half and half. You must believe God for perfect, total, complete healing. Because when you are connected with the mighty power of Almighty God, there is no sickness, no disease, no power of darkness will remain in your life. A bigger amen. All the aches gone, all the pains gone, and they are gone forever. The next testifier. That's the last one for now. Praise the Lord. My name is Chet Ramada James Atajari. I am coming from Bari region. Congoros group Holes District. I want to testify the goodness of the Lord upon me and my family. As I travel December come January, I seek. After the sickness, my legs started peeling like you caught fresh firewood, the teeth started peeling. You see, if I peel it today, tomorrow another one will come up. If my daddy's sister called me and said I should come home, oh, my leg is not 
got that. I said, I'm fine, mommy. I will not come house. I, as I go to church, I hit the, our father in the Lord come for that air prayer. As I come here, I sit down for this down floor. As I, as I come here, I sit down for this down floor. Death has solved today. Like they carry me, took me inside fire. I let go ground. I can even the chairs down like I did for all room. After the man of God finishing preaching, pray like they carry me, took me inside the freezer. Everything's my wound dry. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Put your hands together for Jesus. Give God the glory. Give God the praise. Magnify the name of the Lord. We are going to rise up now and worship the Lord for the miracles, for the demonstration of the power of God. We are going to give God the glory. We are going to celebrate in the presence of God and say, Lord, we thank you. Thank you for the miracles. Thank you for the healing. Thank you for the deliverance. Lift up your voice. If you want, you can lift up your hands, wave your hands to the Lord and say, Lord, thank you. Father, thank you.